Hi, in this video, we are going to be learning how to use the Hugging Face Transformers models for one of the NLP applications, paraphrasing. So I will be using Google Colab with T5 model to paraphrase given sentences. Okay, so before we jump into today's topic, let's make sure all the Google Colab settings are correct. So we go to the runtime tab and click on the change runtime type. So instead of using your local CPU, you can choose either GPU or TPU for your project. Okay, so here I will go with a GPU for this case. All right, so click save and ensure the connection is on. So you can check the information here. All right, I think we are ready to go. So first thing first, uh, install the Transformers library. So you can either click the button here or shift enter on your keyboard to run the code. And it should take a few seconds. So with that, we are able to use those pre-trained models in an easy way. All right, so the next step is to load the tokenizer and the model with from pre-trained function, as you can see here, from pre-trained function. And today, uh, we are testing a model that published by this person, and that is a Google T5 model for paraphrasing applications. Okay, so to run it, and it will take a few seconds as well. All right, so for the test, I prepared four example sentences here. All right, so let's test them one by one. Okay, so let's take a look at the sentence one. Shift enter. So as we can see here, the original sentence is washing your hand properly will keep you away from COVID-19. So the model mm, just changed a little bit. So for example, this model replaced the property to correctly. All right. So let's have a look at the sentence two. Shift enter. So original sentence is Wikipedia was launched on January 15th, 2001 and was created by Jimmy Wales and Larry Sanger. Okay, so we can see the model on uh, it replaced the launched to created and 15th, 15th. Okay, so yeah, so it also did uh, a little bit change for this one. All right. Okay, so let's see the next sentence. Sentence three, shift enter. The original sentence is NLP is one of the interesting fields for data scientists to focus on. Okay. So this model replaced uh, the fields to areas and uh, didn't change the rest of the words. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so let's check out the last sentence, sentence four, shift enter. And sentence four actually is a question. 
The original sentence is, do I really need to take a flu shot if I am healthy with few or no underlying conditions? So we can see the model gave us uh, some sentences here. So the, for example, the first one, uh, do I really need a flu shot? So the model removed the word to and take. And uh, the last sentence here, we can see, do I really need to take a flu shot? The model replaced the if to when. Okay, so I am to I am. All right, so from those sentences, uh, we can see there is still a room to improve uh, the model, right? So in other words, you can get a better result by fine-tuning the model with your own data set and optimize the parameters, okay? Okay, so, all right, that is pretty much the video for today. And in the next video, I'm going to show you how to fine-tune a pre-trained NLP model with your own data set for a specific application. Okay, so don't forget to give us a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.